Greetings to you, beautiful energy. These messages are for Cancer. Thanks for tuning in to your entertaining tarot card messages. Well, I hope so. I love you. I appreciate you. This is a love message. Use your discernment and take the messages that apply. Thanks for all of your support on this journey. It means so much for all of you who support in, in various ways. I feel you. I see you. And of course, I... I, I, you know, it's going to be returned onto you. So much love. So, um, I am getting where, you know, I, I got an energy of the Hunger Games where there are people on the outside that can watch you play and they feel that they are seeing that something is going on with you. And they feel like you don't know what is going on. But this something is horrid. So they can see that there were there was a group of people or three individuals or maybe one person with an idea that did something to you and you did not know about it. And it is still affecting your energy. And they can see. They know that you are an outstanding player and you're still playing. But they know that there was some delays and setbacks as it relates to your love energy. Because these people, these people, some people did something upon you. And you did not know. But you, you, you normally walk alone or move alone. And these people normally move in a group, in a crowd. And somehow you got intermingled with them in some way. And during this interaction with them, this grouping up, somehow they slithered something into your vibration that has affected you. I'm not sure how, but I know that your angels know that this is happening. They somehow cannot reach in and help you. Not that they cannot, but something about the rules right so what like they wish they could tell you it's like they're saying oh poor thing as you go through on your journey this may relate to your fertility or your love life but you're going through something there's something that you're bearing that is not natural to you and they want you to know but it is as if they can't directly inform you you have to know and i feel like you're going to need to start picking up on some signals no so that you can know what this thing is that has been slowing you down, delaying you. I hear alphabet, like alphabet soup. It could be someone's name, A, B, C, D, E, F, G. It could be someone's name, maybe the letters of someone's name. Maybe the letter C, okay? Um, because... So, yeah, you're, need, you're going to need to pay attention to the, the cycles. I'm hearing maybe the cycles of the moon and certain things that you need to be seeing. It's like light energy. Things are going to be standing out like tum, tum, tum for real. And you're going to go mm, 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 th maybe connecting the dots. And you're going to be seeing what has been transpiring in the energy of your love. It's like someone has been underwater, but they did not realize something about, imagine being in a coma inside of a, you know, when um, they put someone in a coma and no, no, not in a coma, but in a sleep cycle. So, and they're among, they're in, it's like you're in water, but it's like jelly, jelly stuff. That energy reminds me of a scene in the matrix or some movie like that, where someone has been deep in sleep. And then when this are underneath some water energy, but it's gel-like. And then this person wakes up and realizes that is where they are. And then you start to choke out now the impurities and the jelly-like substance that has even been ingested in you. You start to like throw it up a little bit off of your chest so that you become awake. I feel like someone has been trying to blind someone, ostracize them or stop them or stop some birth. And I feel like something needs some way to detox or to be realized by you. All right. In your love energy. So the truth that's going to be standing out around you is going to help you to wake up to the truth. The things that are going to be standing out, the signs, the symbols are going to help you to put connect the dots that unlock 
some veil so that you can realize the truth of what is going on so that you can live your life your best life top shelf okay oh my gosh the three swords is next exactly i'm telling you you're in deep in something this could be um with someone's mother or someone's ex the hangman and the three of swords you're in deep for some of you it is the mother of an ex i'm feeling like someone was jealous of you or jealous of their son or the relationship you had with their son okay and for some if I don't need I don't really want to put in the negative energies in your vibration but for some of you like this is a mother that is jealous off of a daughter that was having like a spectacular relationship with a person with the, with her person I just feel with the four swords showing up you did not know a lot of truth that was going on around you and how people were feeling and they were doing very well to hide their feelings injustices some people wanted what you had. Some people were, they were taking you out. I feel like this is your comeback though. Here the rain starting to fall. Six of cups. This is your comeback. You're being saved. That's why I said listen for the signs and the synchronicities around you that are going to help you to wake up. To wake up from where, wake up where you are. It's so amazing. It's like a scene where I don't know if there's a scene in the Matrix where Neo woke up out of a jelly like substance and he started he fell on the floor. You know, he fell he fell on the floor and he was like unclothed and everything. I'm not I can't remember it clearly, but I'm getting something like that. Whatever is going to unplug you or unwaken in you is going to be good. There was something going on. I get a fish or a fish bone. Three of swords. Wow. This could be like magic and spells. I want to connect with you. This energy is telling me someone wanted what you have. Uh, black. The card says black, afraid, shy, hurt, no connection. Someone was feeling like they could not have what you have. And there was also a person that you were with that wanted to keep you bound to them. But, and they were doing these whatever certain things. It's like giving me rumple still thin and spinning the wheel, the spinning wheel like, um, what, what do you call it? Um, look at this card. Yeah, exactly like a spin wheel weaving something together with maybe with your name in it. I'm hearing you need to cut oh my gosh the six of swords there are certain ties that you need to con disconnect from sever cut off and i do feel like that's what you're about to do you're about to feel newness in your life like never before because your redemption is the word you're going to be feeling so beautifully free when you find this truth out and when you make the disconnection you make the connection and then the disconnection Okay, someone wanted to keep you disconnected from source. Someone was trying to hold you up. Three of swords and the hang one. The hang man. Alright. Um, so imagine this is the game, the Hunger Games again. And you are now, you found out what was like making you weak or tired or non-productive. But you, you kind of thought that you were okay because you were, t you know, kind of unaware that something was really affecting you. You thought that you were okay. It's only like your angels from the bird's eye view that could feel like something else. They knew actually that something strange was going on with you, but you were not really seeing exactly what happened. So know that you know the truth and you're making this disconnection. You're going to be feel, you're going to be in the game like a queen of diamonds energy you now, top speed. So you're going to like maybe have your platform, you're making money, you're getting rich, you're getting stability, independence, financial sufficiency, marriage. Um, you know, you're getting all of that now. It's being released onto you. Redemption. Okay, because you're making the connection as to how something was being prevented from moving into your life. As it relates to your relationships. So you could be looking for your husband, your king, your queen. All right. 
So no, as you make these disconnections, you're going to be feeling happier. When you make these disconnections, you're going to know the truth now. So you're going to know for sure who these enemies of yours were or are. And you're going to be feeling three of cups energy as well with the queen of diamonds. Happy, elated, overjoyed. You're, you're, it's like you're so happy to know the truth and know what these people have done to you and has, and to be free from it. No, you're like, I'm a go, I'm a go get my dreams and my goals. I'm going after mine. And these people, they don't know that you're free. They don't know yet. And you know what, too? They had to group up against you because you are greater than them. So they th all three of them thought to put you at a disadvantage and delay you and keep you stuck. Because they didn't want you to achieve your birthright. They thought that you were more efficient, more proper, more beautiful. more You had more of a chance to outshine them and to be selected. And they are right. Because you are natural from inside out. So these people are keen. They were keen to like plot and plan against you, but you 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 are you outdo them because you have support. Six of Swords. Let's make so you know moves. So this person is a person that spoke in your face to you. They told you that they want to work with you. They, that's what they told you. That's what they were telling you. But the whole time in their heart, that was not their intentions. No connections separate from you. Yeah, this person, they were not sharing a similar vision with you. And they were not telling you that that is how they feel. That they were competing with you and they knew in their heart that you were going to outdo them. Or maybe you were, weren't going to choose them. I hear backup or something like that. So, yeah, so this person made had a backup plan. That's what they did. This It's like they set something up. Let's look at the next card. But it did not work. See the five of the five of pentacles is next. This person's backup plan did not work. It did not satisfy. It did not work out how they expected it to at all. This person is running out of money. You hear me? Maybe they wanted you. I'm getting something like a husband and a wife or a living situation, a home. Someone was trying to bring you down. Okay. Um, maybe they were. This was about your house, your living situation. I hear co your co-partner. So with the Five of Pentacles, Cancer, and the Three of Swords card, this person. There was definitely some cheating going on here and some lying. And I'm getting someone was making up stories. Someone was making up stories and putting them in the midst of your connection. Yes, there was a third, a person on this side somehow that was intervening in your vibration. Now, this could be a friend of your ex or a friend of someone or the ex of someone. They, had, they were carrying feelings. And they were doing things. They were walking around with things like potions or whatever. And they were doing their little thing. But you did not know about it. You did not know that this person was carrying feelings. They were carrying money feelings. And they were carrying you know what feelings. The P and D. Yeah. Low key they were trying to itch up. They, they were trying to measure up to you. They felt a little bit like you were going to take their place or something. Someone felt threatened or bothered by your status, by the role that you were playing. I feel like they even blackmailed someone or like something they did. They were like, I, I know something and I'm going to hold you onto something. Something, something, a lot went on. Now you're finding out a lot of the truth. This is what is about to set you free. Because guess what? I'm telling you, you're about to be set so free set free from all of this nonsense let me tell you you're gonna fly like a butterfly yippee jolly breaking free and you're so happy so relieved you're not even holding any malice because the life that is here for you is so much better so fulfilling 
everything that you learned while they had you in cocoon state not the i don't want to give like power to anyone everything that you learned hang one card three of diamonds five of pentacles three of swords i mean i uh, pardon me three of swords um thanks right is you learning about yourself and developing yourself you are doing some shadow work in here hammering the, like you it's like you took up um you took up steel work in the dark you know what i'm saying you built wings or something you were in there doing your thing working at your soul working on your spirit working on your money working on your relationships you were never down ever so that is also why your angels felt inspired to inspire you with signs and synchronicities so that you can realize where you faltered or something like that what happened where your boundaries were trespassed on where you allowed someone i hear this to discrepit where you allowed someone to enter your vibration this could be through food okay this could be through kindness you're sharing and i'm also getting this is the f a person that you don't you did not want to date you refuse this person you may have kept them in the friend zone and they thought that they weren't good enough for you so they drew for the second draw this card to usher you in but it is not working but it was so much work that they've been doing it's like it's incredible your strength okay yeah the number three may be significant look at this <laughs> yo the page of pentacles you get your just rewards i'm telling you flying away freedom leveling up it is as if nothing in the past even matters queen of pentacles someone is coming with an offer to you look at that someone is coming to offer their love up to you with all of their heart someone holds you high oh my gosh up on a pedestal someone knows exactly how they feel for you no questions asked clear communication hope reliance light at the end of the tunnel surely good feelings someone is sure that it is you they you, they are sure how you make them feel they are sure that they're making the right blessed choice you're about to have a level up financially major financial level up and success and make over you may be feeling like you're, you're not feeling well enough or good enough you may feel like you look tired or you need uh, upliftment you know this person is saying it's fine it's okay it's it's okay i got you your energy is about to be lifted up picked up you're about to like go on a joy holiday ride it's like you're going to a theme park you're going on the rides you know you're happy you're not worrying about money you're not worrying about anything you're just laughing and full of joy and prosperity feeling good making good connections not even paying mind to those that were trying to interfere with your vibration your health your health low key you are an alchemist the page of pentacles is my alchemist card cancerian nine of cups you're finding your happiness the angels may be sending someone to you five of cups and you are going to be so special to someone someone needs you and loves you and they're going to show you why you're going to come to a full realization and acceptance of your the fullness of the true lovingness of yourself. You're going to know why. You're going to know why you are who you are, why you are a living legend, why you are outstanding. One day you're going to stand like the mountain pose or on some mountain and you're going to feel like accomplished. Not accomplished, but you're going to feel like a realization of, wow, hmm, this is who I am. This is who I came to be healthy wealthy promising and you're going to be making some good you know what yes as well as money but not you know the grind is not just in the streets it's not just in the streets the ten of diamonds i'm telling you you're going to be making a family the ten of cups 
you are winning your dream come true success you are so happy you your heart is so full and you're leaving these people doing their magic in their mud you're leaving them full of their oils and the dark imagine the mechanics imagine a mechanic um but they get left in the dust so they can't like work against you anymore but they're left in like in the process but also realizing that it's useless it's futile now that's look sorry this card says sorry someone is sorry that they try to work against you that's how i am feeling they're sorry they because they're realizing that they were trying to take away your power four diamonds look value having value really want to hold you someone just really wanted to be with you nine of diamonds that's all that they wished for eyes full of stars daydreamer and someone really wanted to be you or to be have what is yours and they're just realizing they just have to accept the page of pentacles the ten of cups that you've gotten away you are the best you're the best thing they've ever had or you're the best thing that they will never be marriage all right this could even be a family member in some way that was controlling and possessive and all of these things and you were you just drove away in your red convertible eloping success oh my gosh look eight of cups and this eight of cups even though i said driving away in your red convertible yes but it's also telling me that someone is coming toward you Someone is coming toward you and they're following their heart. This person is on weight. Someone is making their way. They could be like actively walking right now. But they won't get here till like three days time. <laughs> it's something like that. Someone is making their way through the forest, through the storms, through everything. They're actively in their heart space, in the momentum. You can feel this person arriving nine of wands says ready for love i am ready this person has been ready about to flourish they can't wait anymore expectation and be ready so expect me to show up all right that's the energy that they're saying You're, and this is going to make you rich and happy wow oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my goodness oh my goodness oh my goodness oh my gosh the ten of cups and the ten of pentacles you're going to be so rich and so happy. The six of cups. You're going to be saying, yippee, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Falling in love. Natural vibe. Familiar feeling. Someone is going to take your hand. And someone is pregnant. Naturally love you. Deeply love you. There's a person from your past, like a person you've met before or known for a long time, growing up, childhood energy, possibly a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. Yeah, confirmation that has something to say to you. They want to make a vow or they want to tell you what has been on their heart. Listen, this card says, say something. This card says, no, I want to, I long to, I hope to. It is my wish to have you. That is, you are someone's dream come true. And this could be a confession from a person that has been trying to keep you bound to them. And they're coming to realize that they need to face you and tell you what's been going on and explain to you why they were doing it. It is all because I love you and it is all because I want you for myself. It is all because I want to have a family with you. And I'm telling you, someone is moving toward you that is kneeling in front of you and they have so much to say. You may have some options, but oh my gosh, but there's only one real person like out here. The true one that is on way to you, that's following in their heart. This person is a leader, a way maker. Alright, this card says, get ready for this person. This card says, not luck, but a beauty. <clears throat> Excuse me, not luck, but a beautiful connection. Not luck, but a beautiful connection. A zing, a feel good, a natural vibe, a sign of value, decent values, f a fine mind, familiar values, and a soulmate. Two of diamonds. And someone is so hurt, three of swords, that they know that you have a true love and they know you are not, they, they are not for you. Yes, seven of swords. 
and they're admitting someone is like admitting right now in this reading they're saying like they can admit that this they were really doing something but they kind of see that they have to let you go forward because they have to heal too because this person is feeling like they got too attached to you so into you you've like left such a deep mark on someone for some of you this is like i said a family member um that they were carrying some malice and they just realized that they're gonna they're gonna have to let it go let it go let it be for some reason right it could be the most high because this card says rooted roots this person has been doing this for a long time these three people are this one person family creation they were trying to block your 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 childhood or your you creating life if if you're masculine they were trying to stop you from planting seeds and feminine they were trying to stop your portal from bringing forth life you know someone is like deciding to give it up i know this message is hard to hear but anywho these like i'm telling you like this you are winning and the truth is coming out emperor the emperor is feeling like a presence of protection for me like a loving guiding protection that is around you that is not gonna let anything happen to you that is looking out for you this is like a father or a, just a beautiful guide and spirit like a real king that really masters and governs his kingdom and just sees to justice justice and fairness even if you're not this person's who and like family they are the emperor they are the king for the the kingdom so they're gonna make sure say the kingdom is running well that's the energy of this card it could be a father i don't know but anywho so someone is seeing to some justice for you in your favor so i feel like you're not alone you have like a strong masculine energy on your side in some way or you are this strong masculine energy that is getting your way because you 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 are putting yourself down like you're putting your foot down you know like i have a word i'm i'm getting my way i do not get walked over you know so you it's like a man kind of vibration so yeah someone that is gonna see to it that you get your justice having value really want to hold you yep that's what i'm seeing there's someone defending you protecting you maybe a lawyer someone someone is also going to be sorry for talking bad about you seven of swords calling you out of your name and i feel like you're so innocent and sweet that you 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 weren't even d doing anything you were just but you, it's not like you won't defend yourself you know you were just really minding your business because you have so much to do queen of wands but you're so magnificent and attractive and beautiful powerful and attractive that a lot of attention come to you look the queen of diamonds the queen of the king of diamonds there's something with your dreams it's a cups like overflow of love you get a lot of a love offers yes i love you become one express love release love 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 all kind of things about i wish i could <laughs> i hear laughter okay so yeah, I feel you're about to be healed. Like I was saying earlier, cutting these connections from a karmic, toxic person um, because you're being defended and protected in spirit and in physical. And everything, that, oh my gosh, everything that is yours is returning. So you're going to be back on your course in alignment with following your heart as it relates to your love energy. Okay? And um, you're, everything is going to be back in in alignment <laughs> you're gonna be back in the game you know and i'm feeling like there are people nine ones that won't like to see that they're gonna be like oh they thought they voted you out and here you come back in the game so you have to be careful of that as well but i feel like you're safe because whatever happened was somehow unfair and you're going to be naming these people or calling them out Three of them, you know, I feel they stand around and talk or they stand around and eat. Yeah. Numbers five, two, seven, three, Queen of Swords. They may have like a leader. 
And the last card, wow, this is so amazing to me. Because your final card is the four of wands. And this is the, like for me, and I love reading in this energy now is one of the best cards. Chemistry, yin yang, peace, harmony, marriage, going out, just a balanced connection of happiness and joy. And it's just everything like to like you know and this is such a blessing i'm telling you it's such a blessing and i feel like when when this happens maybe when you meet with this person see you're going to be meeting with them marrying them maybe whatever kind of union this is it's beautiful and it's real People are going to see it. The ones that didn't want to see that. They're going to see it, right? And they're going to feel like they can't really do anything about it. They couldn't stop it. And, um... Yeah, you're, you're so happy. I will see you in the next one. Take it easy out there. All is well and all is within you discipline focus interested well not interested um you're going to be releasing something i'm telling you in the name of jesus christ of nazareth whatever whoever however you are firm you are i feel like any bind anything any weapon formed you're dispelling it you're finding the answer like you're finding what it is that you need to get your power back to get your strength back to wake up to wake up where you are to see the truth to to re to repel whatever this is to cut off from it to, to exercise from it to disconnect from it free yourself from it and leave it behind and move on from from you know swim up catch fresh breathe air you were like trapped in water and they thought that they would have left you there 